everyone going to do a quick video on how to upgrade the light sockets on pretty much any classic car uh, these are gm off of a 1970 chevy c10 if you're going to go through and redo the whole wiring on the truck you may as well go ahead and replace these sockets as you can see the bulbs will break sometimes the springs that are actually in them a lot of times will go bad so it's hard to get them to get new bulbs in so I'll walk you through the process on changing these out. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is knock out this ring here from the inside of the lens. And the easiest way to do that is take a screwdriver and pry on it to bend it up enough, but then you can punch it through to get the old socket out. Once that's out, you've got that. All right, so now I'm gonna take a step drill bit just to open this up just a little bit as these are universal sockets. So you need a little bit of opening. Uh, I actually open it up to, it's the 13 sixteenths. Kinda hard to see that. Um, I think it's right at three quarter right now. I open up to 13 sixteenths and the sockets fit in good. All right, and once that's done, you can then take your socket and you'll see that it still doesn't fit. But you bend these tabs in a little bit and then you'll be able to get it fit in. And now that the socket fits in like that, we'll flip it over and get these tabs and bend them down. So that way it secures the socket into the housing. All right, so we'll set the socket in the vise, just do lightly tightened, put the housing over it, and then we'll go and bend these tabs back down. Found a good thing is use these screw holes here, put some needle nose in, and you can get two of them started if you line them up right. And that makes it a lot easier to get the other ones in. Then just take a screwdriver and hammer and bend the other ones back over. And there's what it looks like once you have the new socket in. It's a nice flush fit. You can just pull this out, twist it to get it just right. You may have to spin it some to make sure that it clears. There's a little tab down in there. and ready for your new bulb. So that's how you switch out the sockets in any old classic car, classic truck, GM, Ford, pretty much all the same. And they make the universal ones. These are the 1157 bulbs. I'll leave a link in the description on where to get the sockets. Thanks for watching.